What? Ele or water elemental. Oh, it's oh, coming right for us! Um, pause! Um... This would be a good time to use my electrical loop, I think. I don't know, it's a lesser one. Oh no, this is a large one, so maybe. Okay. Um... My druid will cast the fire weapon on him, on his weapon. I don't think that's going to have a huge effect, but we'll cast it anyways. I like the epic music. Epic music's cool. Okay, I'm ready. Hey, I told it. There we go. I'm just gonna get in here in combat. Oh, it's injured. Oh, there's a... There's an ice method over here. Oh, I didn't see him. The and then there's another one coming. They broke down the door. It looks like because the doors are shattered. Oh, I oh, see. Yeah. I see three. No, four. I think there's four ice methods coming. Um. Okay, I'm gonna keep my splash buckler on this elemental, and I'm gonna move my cleric back around. Um. I'm going to move my druid to the ice ones as well, because I think the uh, fire damage I have on my sword will be more effective against them. Um, okay. And then I'm going to keep I'm casting gonna keep lightning. The hunter attacking. You ready? Yes. Okay, and then lightning again. Last one. Oh, I think there's actually five of those. Did you just cast Bless? Is that that giant glowing light? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna cast yeah, Fireball. Yeah, I'm casting some heals. That elemental's almost dead. Yep. Okay. Um... I'm ready to go when you are. Yes! Stupid fire, or stupid ice methods. Fireball for the win. Okay, oh, oh, she's getting pretty hurt by this one behind me though. Um, stick the druid on that one. And then, I'm gonna try and move the mage away, the sorcerer. Let me know when you're ready, just unpause it. Uh, go. Oh. There's still more of the ice methods coming. Um. Oh, but I think we just killed two. So I kill that one. And then there's... Actually, no, I should stick the druid on the one attacking my sorcerer. And then... Is that water elemental not dead yet? No. Okay. I'm ready when you are. Okay. Druid, get in there. Okay. Sorcerer's safe. Didn't take that much damage. Can you focus on that water elemental? I just want to get it dead. Okay, I'll cast magic missile on it. Okay, I'm ready when you are. Ah, uh, like sometimes it's like my spell doesn't go off. Yeah, I find that sometimes too. It's almost like the the it doesn't get registered with the server or something. Yes, it's down. Okay, then cast magic missile on that method. Oh, not necessary. Dead before nice. I could get the spell off. All right, we went. Uh, that was I. I think that was pretty good. Um. Oh, we've got some ice method corpse. Am I pronouncing that right? Method. Method. Yeah, method. 
Mephit. Okay. That's right. Sure. Go with it. Sure. What the? Yep. Uh, what did the water elemental drop? Uh, elemental essence. Okay, that's probably another bounty item. Okay, well. Uh, no, a crafting component apparently. Oh. Oh, that might be used for uh, making some sort of plus magical weapon or something. I don't really want to walk in here, but there looks to be, if we hold... Oh, there's nothing we can there's use in there. Where do you there's see? There's a chest in here. Oh. That's okay. Should we talk to him, or...? Oh, so there's a vault key, an unidentified scroll, and an, a miscellaneous medium object unidentified. Ooh, those can I'll be pass really them handy. To your, uh, yeah. Um. Okay, you hand them oh, over. Oh, it's a raised dead scroll. Oh. You should be able to use that, shouldn't you? Yep. Okay. Uh, accept. And I will cast identify on it. I'm down to one level one spell left now. Uh, and it is a brooch of shielding. Examine. Uh, three shields per day. Caster level five. That's actually really good if I remember shield. Plus four AC bonus and also makes you immune to magic missile. Oh, okay, it's just the same dialogue from before when you talk to him? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna hand that amulet to my druid. Because that way my druid will be able to cast um, an AC bonus without needing my sorcerer. Okay. Um, so then I can do stuff like this shield. And now he's got 20 AC, and then I can also put the natural AC bonus of Bark Skin on him as well to put it up to 24. I think. Yeah. Which is really nice because it's a it's a per day item, not a just a, a so many uses. Oh, that is good then. I was yeah. going to say, I hate things that have charges, and they're, like, after the charges are gone, that's it. No, but this is an actual, um, three charges per day item. And level five, I, well, what is the, one second, I'm going to just check out the spell, because my sorcerer actually knows the spell herself, but it's a per, the other thing is shield can only be cast on caster, so it's a nice thing, um. Oh, yeah. Oh, right, the duration is based on the level, so it's a, it's a five minute, uh, five minute use. Which I don't think is too long, so probably shouldn't have casted one on myself, but whatever. <laughs> um, yeah, it seems like this room's kind of empty. Oh, he's back again. Oh, he's back again. Oh, he's on his way back. Oh. Trap? I'm gonna, yeah. Do you I have any heals left? It. Uh, yeah. Okay, because I've still got four Cure Light Wounds. So we have a couple scrolls, a journal, a vault key, and an empty ring of genie sh summoning. Ooh. Or Jin. However you want to pronounce it. I forget, can we actually recharge those items, or are they just, like, empty and that's it? Uh, I don't know. Hmm. It has a unique power that has unlimited uses, apparently. Oh, this ring has been especially tuned to imprison a specific genie. So, I guess the guy that we're going to run into is a genie. Oh. And it's cool. Yeah. Plot device. Okay, and then there's a last chest over there. I'm going to see if we can rest. Oh. Yeah, not looking like it. Damn. <laughs> It's interesting because uh, yeah, like normally in any other sort of dungeon, in the in the original campaign, it's just like anytime there's no enemies around, you can just rest. But here, it's just it's interesting because it's like the outside is really the rest zone, 
which I guess means most of the dungeons we're going to run into are going to be small like this, where it's really just sort of one combat, maybe two combat, and then you got to try and make do. Yeah. Which should make things a little more strategic, but... Because, like, I know when I uh, I was playing the, the main campaign or whatever, it's just like, I would just be like, okay, could use up all my spells, and then be like, okay, now I guess I'll rest, and everything's back. Whoa, yeah. a bunch of unidentified scrolls. Does your sorceress learn spells through scrolls? I've no. A sorcerer, uh, when she gains a level, has to select spell uh, spells. And then... Um, And uh, those are the spells she knows. She can cast them from scrolls, but she can't learn any new ones. But when she gains levels, she can uh, she can uh, remove a spell to uh, exchange, like one spell per level or something. Okay, yeah. Lower than her maximum known spell. So, like, if she knows, like, I think level three right now, she can't exchange out fireball at the moment, but she could exchange out any of my lower level spells for another one of the same level. Um. But she can use all of these scrolls, so if we get into a tight spot, I might want to use one of these. I'm just going to throw them down on my quick fire so I can look at them quickly. And... I just I just barely made that check. <laughs> I can't see what your checks oh, what? are. <laughs> Another trap? You yeah, need higher... You need, reflex save. you need higher search or something. Yeah, uh, I gotta put some more points into Rogue. I only have two. So a flute? In a ring. A flute? Yeah. If you have a bard character, you use instrument. Okay. Let's see what they're worth. Well, I don't think I can appraise them, really, but... Um... I've only got one more identify left, so I'll use it on the ring, because that's probably more... More pressing. Of minor cold resist. Oh, that would have come in handy a few moments ago. Um, yeah. Oh, whoops, I dropped it. Always dropping stuff. Um, yeah, so it's a ring resistance to cold 10. Slash dash. I have a feeling this guy's going to be some sort of frost genie. So who should have the ring then? Um, maybe this washbuckler. Okay, that's what I was thinking. Just hand it back to you now that we know it's not cursed. Although I haven't run into any cursed items in this, so I don't know if this game has that sort of thing. Oh, hold on. Oh. Oh, okay, I, I totally forgot we had to open that door. He's probably going to be in that, that room. Either that or we're going to walk in and, like, steal all his loots, and he's going to come in here being like, Rawr! Maybe in the middle of the circle here? I want to stand away from that. Yeah, try to position the characters. And maybe save beforehand? Okay, um... I think I'm gonna cast a couple light wounds on Steve Dave. Steve Dave's. There we go. Shouldn't be completely useless now, he's almost full health. Actually, I use a couple of mine or two. Whenever you're ready. Alright, let's do this. <laughs> 